Yo, what is going on guys? Max Knives here, and today in this video I'm going to do something very original that you've probably never ever seen any other YouTuber do before, and that's a Q&A video, <laughs> as you can probably tell by the title of the video. But anyways, before we get into the questions, I wanted to thank you guys again so much for 2,000 subscribers. It's absolutely amazing. Um, I didn't think that I'd get this far, obviously. It always have been like a big hope in the back of my head that I'd get this far, um, but now it's a reality, and it's just becoming more and more a reality every day for my ultimate goal, which is just to make a living off of YouTube. And and um, obviously we're still a long way from there, but uh, like I said, it's just like the snowball effect, you know, we're going to keep going and going and going until we're this giant thing. And so I wanted to thank you guys again so much for that. It means the world to me. And we're already at 2.2K, which is amazing. That's over 300 subscribers just this week gained alone. And of course, I know it's from that Jev video, but it's honestly so awesome that you guys have come over from that Jev video. And I wanted to thank you guys again for that. And so yeah, now let's head into the questions. All right, first question is going to be from at XJMXLoth. He says, do you eat spaghetti 666? Um, duh. I, I eat spaghetti. Okay, for the next question, I actually got a lot of questions about this topic, so I just put them all together, and so I'm going to answer uh, basically all of them with just this answer. And basically, that is, uh, how did I start YouTube? Who inspired me? When did I start YouTube? And uh, where do I think I'm going to go in the future? And where do I want to take it, basically? So I started YouTube four years ago. It was um, it was my freshman year, and I had just gotten one of those Dazzles. If you don't know what a Dazzle is, um, I actually have one here. I'll go get it real quick. So this is a Dazzle. If you don't know what a Dazzle is, is um they're actually it's basically just like an Elgato or a PVR except they're really really shitty quality um I don't even know why it says HD on there because it's not HD at all it only has the three components for um the yellow white and red it only has those three components as you can hear you can look at the back and just see like how it hooks up to your TV or whatever and it basically it was just it's just a capture card it's the same thing as a Hop Hog HD PVR or a Elgato, except it's not HD and it's really shitty quality. I think the highest it can go is 480p. Um, but anyways, this is what I used to record when I was uh, a freshman, and I don't even think Elgatos were invented back then. It was just uh, PVRs were the next best thing you could get. And uh, But PVRs were too expensive, and so I bought this for like 50 or $80, I think, and PVRs at the time were like 200 So I got this, and this is what I used to make my videos with. And if you dig really deep in my channel you can probably find uh, those really old videos I deleted most of them which I really wish I hadn't because I could look back and see how much I've improved since then but some of them you can still find really down deep in there uh, that's what she said by the way and now what inspired me to do YouTube uh, only use me blade inspired me make you say WTF inspired me um, they were both kind of like uh, stealthy ninja like guys going around knifing people and I always thought that that was like the coolest thing and so uh, I started uh, YouTube by doing that kind of stuff and making videos like that except they were really shitty quality and poorly edited I used uh, Windows Movie Maker back then uh, now I use Sony Vegas by the way if you guys didn't know and I have a Hop Hog HD PVR 2 and that's what I used to record and stuff and these guys really inspired me to get into it and then about a year and a half ago I found Jev's channel off of a Rage Taj this was when he was in uh, Team Caliber and I just thought he was like the funniest guy ever like these rage Taj's would make me laugh so hard and I just loved his videos and so um, after watching his videos that's what inspired me to start uploading more frequently on my channel because he started doing videos like every day and so that's what made me go from like uploading every month to uploading uh, weekly and now I'm uploading almost daily which is really awesome and I'm gonna continue to do that until uh, I reach my dream which comes to the question of where do I want to take YouTube and uh, my dream for YouTube is to be able to make a living off of it no matter what that means I'm not looking to get into to a specific clan because I know someone asked me like what's my uh, dream clan I don't have a dream clan or anything like that uh, I'm not hoping to get in phase obviously if I'm able to get into phase I'm gonna take that but I'm not looking to get into phase I'm not looking to get into any big teams especially when I suck um, I just really like making these entertaining videos for you guys but my ultimate dream is to just be able to make a living off of YouTube make this be my job because I love doing it so much and whatever job I have in the future uh, I want to be able to make a living off of what I love to do because then it doesn't seem like an actual job you're just doing what you love and that's that's really what I, anyone wants i think next question is from i knives he says fuck mary kill bobo blaziken or iced well i'm an adult now so if i fucked iced i think i'd technically be jailed for uh being a pedophile and i can't marry him either so i guess we'll go with kill iced i don't know how old Bo 
Lobo is. I think he's older than Ice, but I think he's still younger than 18. So uh, I guess we'll go with, uh, I don't know, this is hard. You guys know that Blaziken's been in lots of pornos, so I guess that we'll go with fuck Blaziken and then marry Bobo, I guess. All right, now we're gonna really start cruising on the other questions. Knife Jets wants to know what's the first game I've ever played. Uh, the first game I've ever played was, uh, it's actually really hard to remember. The first one I really enjoy playing that I really got into was uh, Spyro, but I remember playing like Donkey Kong and stuff like that on the Nintendo 64 when I was like three years old. Uh, but first game that I really enjoyed playing was definitely Spyro on the PlayStation 1. At Quincy wants to know how I get the ideas for my videos slash series, and I get ideas for my videos constantly just flowing in my head either when I'm taking a shower or sometimes when I'm at school, and to make sure that I don't forget these ideas later, I actually write them down in this journal right here, and I carry this journal around in my backpack and I always have it at home with me. I basically always have it on me, and uh, if I ever have an idea or something like that that I want to use for a video, I just write it down in the journal real quick. And and then I can come back to it later. Taz Knife wants to know what my dream clip is. As you guys know, I don't hit clips very often, so uh, my dream clip would definitely be something that's just so insane because if I was consistent, that would be better than just one amazing clip, but I'm not consistent and he's just asking what a dream clip would be, and it would just be something, I don't even know specifically what it would be, probably something like a five man and then me randomly throw a six tomahawk to randomly hit someone cross map, that'd be pretty fucking awesome for kill cam too um amaya wants to know if i would ever do uh open lobbies with fans and i would definitely love to do open lobbies with fans i didn't really know if you guys wanted me to do that or not um i can definitely do that maybe for 3k or something like that i'll do an open lobby and we can just play for two hours and i'll just invite people randomly you just let me know you just send me a message and i'll invite you and then we'll we'll all play michael myers or something like that rama wants to know if we'll ever meet again because i met him in a lobby a while ago when ghost was still a popular game and i definitely think we could play again rommel hopefully when uh, i do an open lobby you'll be invited to that so that'll be fun dan's sp wants to know my opinion on promotions i definitely think shout outs are okay especially if you think that person deserves a shout out but i don't like paid promotions uh, if you don't know what that is that's basically when uh, a small youtuber pays a big youtuber to give them a shout out i think that's stupid but but if the smaller channel really wants to give this money for a shout out um, i mean that's okay but uh i don't really like that but that's just my opinion Krayus wants to know if there would be any games that i would want to upload to my channel that i haven't yet um, definitely I want to do more horror games. Um, there's not any really specific games, but I'm definitely looking to post more Let's Plays in the future, so definitely look out for that. Jumpshot wants to know what my favorite horror movie is, and I don't think I have a specific horror movie just because I hate everything to do with horror and being scared. Some people like that kind of stuff. I don't like it. The only reason I play horror games is because it's entertaining to go back and watch and see my reaction, but like when I'm playing a game that's either scary or if I'm watching a scary movie, I fucking hate it. I hate the horror genre. I, I absolutely despise it so i don't think i have a favorite horror movie demise concepts wants to know what would i do if i were trapped in a bouncy castle but the walls were made of dicks fallen edits wants to know am i still your block placing nigger yes knife life wants to know caught online that's not really a question but yes duck dzn wants to know can a crypt donate blood uh, well, I like to think of myself as mentally crippled, and I've given blood before, so I guess so. Apollo wants to know, what is my favorite game besides COD? I definitely love any kind of RPG. If you don't know what RPG is, it's a role-playing game, uh, basically when you take on the role of a specific character. And I love all of Bethesda uh, Studios games. They've made uh, Skyrim and Fallout, and Fallout 3 is definitely my favorite game of all time. Uh, I spent so many hours in that game, like literally, I have almost every achievement in that game just the survival and the story just everything about that game i love it and so uh fallout 3 is definitely my favorite and they might be announcing fallout 4 at e3 this year so i'm super excited for that trans effects wants to know can i be your junior uh i don't see why not and then, of course, I figured that I was going to get one of these questions in this Q&A, and I actually got asked twice, what color is the dress, uh, blue and black or gold and white? And I don't know why everyone's arguing about this. Uh, it's definitely red and black. I don't know why you guys don't see it. Spike Ball Cams wants to know, can I knack? No, but I can jack off. 
Rise Macro wants to know what my plans are for when Make You Say WTF comes back and am I going to be uploading Ninja videos as well as my regular uploads and I definitely want to be hanging out with uh, Mitch or Make You Say WTF when he comes back because I used to play with him all the time and I don't know if I'll be uploading Ninja videos I might do like one or two and see if you guys like that and if you guys do I'll continue if you don't I'll stop but uh, I definitely want to hang out with Mitch when he comes back I think that'd be really awesome especially with him being one of the people that inspired me to do YouTube. Oh Swift wants to know send nudes question mark uh swiss my nudes cost money and they're not cheap sebiax wants to know how long is your schlong what is a schlong what is a schlong oh i should not have clicked images at becca gold asks uh you told me to ask you this how are you so attractive? Uh, I didn't tell her to say that. Who put that in there? At Pickups wants to know, how are you so damn talented? Um, I don't think I have a lot of talent. I just put videos on YouTube and you guys watch them. And I appreciate that you guys enjoy watching my weirdness. At All Blade No Gun asks, how old are you? I am, uh, I was born on November 3rd, 1996, which makes me... 18. My age is also in my Twitter bio, by the way. At Goldfish's Blade wants to know, why don't you play naked? Well, you guys never see me from the waist down, so technically you don't know that, but <laughs> the reason I don't play naked is because I live in Washington State and it rains here constantly and it is really fucking cold here. At 72nd Observer wants to know what my favorite kind of game is, uh, an RPG, FPS, MMO, or MOBA, and um, all of them you can definitely put multiple hours into, but I definitely say an RPG is the funnest to do it. I love all kinds kinds of games, all of those kinds of games I love to play, but I definitely say by far RPGs are the funnest to just sit down in a dark room and play for hours, so uh, definitely RPG. At Fiber Edits wants to know, why am I your favorite person in SP? Um, you're not. I'm just kidding. <laughs> no, I'm not. At Neko Knives wants to know, would you rather be raped by a big black guy or never have sex in your entire life? Um, well, if I get raped by the big black guy, I'm not guaranteed to have sex any time in my life, so I'll definitely just go with, uh, stay a virgin for the rest of my life. And our last question is going to be from at Psycho Knives. He asks, if I punched myself in the face and it hurts, am I strong or am I weak? So that's going to do it for this Q&A. I answered every question that was asked, so I hope you guys appreciate that, and that's why the video is so long. Um, but again, thank you guys so much for 2K. It's still mind-blowing that I have 2,000 subscribers. I'm 2% of the way there to that silver play button, which is, honestly seems like it's so far away. But it doesn't matter because we're going to pick up speed here in a few months, and we're going to start going really fast. And I uh, hope you guys are excited for that. Hope you guys stay subscribed and uh, follow me along the way. Again, guys, thank you guys so much for 2,000 subscribers, and thank you for for watching make sure to smack that like button if you enjoyed the q a and i'll do future q a's anyways thanks for watching again guys this has been max peace